Well, we have a special tour here for you today. I always say we. It's just me, you guys. It's Chance. And uh, yeah, it's just me, but I don't know why I say we, but I guess I'm speaking for everybody here, which is which where we are at is at the Biloxi Manufacturer Housing Show. This is a home by Fleetwood. They have several homes right here, a part of Cavco. We got Destiny Homes. Got to tour them for the first time. And so that'll be coming, may already be on the channel, but it's a, it's a really sweet house. But today, this is a two bed, two bath uh, home that is a 76 link in length. So it's a, it's a big house, but it's only two bedrooms. Plus it has a porch. I believe based on what y'all tend to really like, I think y'all really, really gonna enjoy this tour. So I just, you know, I wanna briefly walk around here, the exterior, and I'm gonna step on the other side. I'd like to give you a shot of some of the other homes and then we'll make our way inside. Hope y'all are having a wonderful day. I'm telling you what, when I first got here, it was cold, it was windy, but now this is my last day here and uh, it's perfect. I mean, right here in Biloxi, Mississippi, I wish Caitlin and Cullen was with me. I may, you know, shoot, just head down, head down to the beach for a couple days. Would be nice. But yeah, here's a couple other houses we're gonna be touring. Uh, there's a few over here. Let's see what we got. So the only thing I really want to show you is this outlet that we have here. We got our water faucet in our back door with a uh, light fixture there. Let's head back around, head onto the porch. Okay, here we go. Let's step up on the porch. Would y'all please consider dropping a like on the video? Wow, what about this ceiling fan? I like that. And it's, and it's just so nice out here today. This porch is just perfectly. Sometimes I do tours and I'm out on the porch, it's like pouring down rain and freezing cold. And I'm like trying to make it sound like it's good, but it's like, you really just want to get inside. But today, wow, this is what porch living's all about. Y'all don't forget to subscribe and notification bell. We've got a window here on this end. Let's make our way inside. Today's video is sponsored by Cascade Financial. Cascade has specialized in manufactured home loans since 1999. So whether you're looking to finance the home only or the home and land together, Cascade has the right program for you. Y'all don't forget to stick around to the end. We'll get into all types of information on this home stuff that I think you're definitely gonna wanna know. But for now, let's head inside. Okay. So, why well, I'm really excited about this house, two reasons. And then I'll, I'll quiet down a little bit. I know I've been talking nonstop is this home has that front uh, living room and kitchen set up. I did one of these in Louisville at that show and y'all loved it, okay? That's one reason. Another reason is that it's a two bedroom, I know I've already said, and man, lots of space, lots of space in every, in every room, every area. So as I make a turn right here, I do want to give you one shot of this flooring. Where are you watching from? I've just, just thought about that. I'm kind of curious. Where are you watching from? I'd love to hear hear from y'all. Uh, I hadn't been able to get on the channel this week because I've been doing so much to really reply to comments, but uh, the video's been coming out and someone's been doing really good. So I appreciate that. But but it's always interesting, you know, to kind of hear where y'all residing at. I love this backsplash. Several electrical outlets. We got our Stonecrest Vinna Hood. Now this video isn't brought to you by Stonecrest because it's brought to you by, I'm just kidding, it's not brought to you by Whirlpool either, but we have Whirlpool appliances in this house, stainless steel. You got the white cabinets, black countertops. You just can't go wrong with that. It's one of my personal favorites. The white cabinets with the uh, black pools, also one of my personal favorites. This area here reminds me a lot of that home that y'all love so much from Louisville. And then things get really different once we get out of here. But here's your, uh, you know, your your nook, your kind of little dining area. You could do a few different things right here. Uh, I know it kind of seems a little small, but we still got the bar stools over here. So, 
you know, you got you got a lot of room to eat. I mean, <laughs> first of all, I know I said I was going to quit rambling so much, and I have not done that yet. I recognize that. But you know what? When I was growing up, we used to have these TV trays. Y'all still do that? We had these TV trays we would pop out, and we would eat on the couch. Man, I know a lot of people still do that. We need, Caitlin, if you're watching, we need to do that. Here's spot for your washer and dryer. And I like how they changed up your sheetrock here just to, you know, give a little different look. But, you know, you think about it, if your washer and dryer is sitting there, it's going to cover up, you know, somewhere to ride, right around here. But then you have that top area. Oh, okay. The other side is the bath. That's where we're going to go next. Oh. You see some more of that sheetrock in here. <laughs> this is a nice guest bathroom for a single wide, you know. Sometimes those single wide bathrooms, they get a little tight. Not only you got a linen closet in here, but then you just got a lot of area. So right there is where the back door is positioned. Now we're gonna come into this area. Check this out. So they was just telling me they kind of really did some things in this model, to, you know, since it was gonna be their show model to kind of show off some stuff. So just keep in mind, you might could, I don't know, I don't know really what you could, can and can't do, but you might could tinker a few things if you're like, you know, I would rather my closet be there. I don't even know if I should say that because I really don't know. Y'all know I just do the tours, but I would think maybe you could. Uh, but, but that is nice here just to see something different. You got all those drawers. And then here's the main bedroom. Got this wall here as well. Walk-in closet. Big for a single wide, right? And I'm seeing this. Okay, it's probably gonna be where you can get access to like your shower. No, no, no. Wait, let me, let me, let me, let me check that out. No, no, let's see. Is that gonna be? No, you get access. If you need access to your shower, you would do it there. So that's probably where your uh, water heater is going to be, I bet. I bet that's what it is. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, only thing we got left to do is go in this bathroom. We have a tub and shower. Double sinks. The commode here with the cabinet over it, I think is very nice. Got this mirror that goes all the way up to the, almost to the top of the ceiling. Got the recess lights in here. What about the size of this tub in this single wide set up, in this single section home? It's pretty great, huh? Plus you got this huge window. And last but not least, we're gonna take a look at our shower. So
So this house right here is gonna be something I think y'all really gonna enjoy to see. Um, you know, there's been so many unique homes that I've got to tour here at the show. I really, for me to classify like this is one of the coolest ones, I can't say that. I, I, don't really, I would really have to go home and process everything that I've seen this week. But for the right person, I believe this house is super cool because it's so big for a single wide, uh, it's, but it's only got two bedrooms. Plus it's got this front living room and kitchen. Y'all stick around, I'll provide information for you that I think will be resor resourceful. And, uh, but don't forget to subscribe and notification bell. Uh, the one thing I've been trying to say in most of the videos is please, 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 you know what I'm gonna say, share this video. You're like, he says it every video, but you still ain't done. <laughs> please share it with someone, put it on social media, and don't forget to like it. Thank you. Okay, it's time for the outro. This is the Fleetwood part of the Pinnacle series, the 1676-2, and I think that two is referring to, wait, two bedrooms, C. It's the 1676-2C. The C, the, the, C, the C stands for, you guessed it, chance. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. I don't know what it stands for, but my oh my, what a beautiful home. And like I've already talked about for 12 minutes, I'm eager to see what y'all think about it. So do me a favor and drop a comment if you would. Uh, we're gonna get to some information. I'll have some stuff in the description. As always, y'all know the deal. Links are in there. We got several. Let me talk about a couple of them. One of them is a link to our website where you can get in contact with someone, see about getting yourself financed and pre-approvals or anything like that on this home or any home on the channel. Use that link. Plus we have our members area link where we take a deep dive in each week, the homes that I tour, just information that I try to provide that we don't have time to cover here in the videos, plus an exclusive look at stuff we got coming up, like where I may be going on a trip next week to video some houses. <sighs> I'll probably share it in there in the exclusive video. The members area video, links in the description. And then the other link, I know I said a couple, I know a couple means two, but I'm gonna give you three. The other one is the link to our second channel. You need to check that out if you have it. Uh, we got we got all kinds of stuff on there. You need to you need to take a look at that. So I'm gonna get into some retail estimated pricing on this house. Before we do that, I would like to say that our videos do come out Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday night. And uh, I know I had kind of talked about putting out that uh, home from Hilltop Structures out tonight, but I decided to do this one. So it'll be coming next week with a basement and everything. And I think I think that's the one I'm gonna put out. I got a few others at the dealership. I may do one of those. But anyways. Uh, next week, we've got a week full of beautiful homes and plush. Yeah, like I said, I'm going somewhere. Getting some brand new content for y'all. So stay tuned uh, to the channel as always. Now, let's get into some estimated retail pricing. And exactly what I just said. It's estimated. It's retail pricing. I'm just touring these homes to show y'all what's out there. Just just to, trying to build a catalog for y'all where y'all can go to the channel and be like, oh, I want to see this house. I want to see You know, and maybe spend a day and a half just watching videos. I don't know. Uh, but that's just kind of... <laughs> No, but that, you know, I'm not personally selling these homes, okay? Y'all know that. I think most of y'all know that. But I do like to provide some type of idea on pricing because I know when I look at stuff, I like to have an idea on pricing. And so it's just kind of what this is about. But just keep in mind, it depends on where you're getting this house, the county regulations, the state fees, all the, you know, the freight charges, a lot of stuff we don't know when I'm giving you this price. Just keep all that in mind. This will be a just a, a range. And it's going to be right here, right now. There you go. That's going to be a great idea, but you can get this on for. And i tell you what I want to do. I want to go ahead. I know tomorrow isn't Mother's Day, but I'm going to go ahead and tell all y'all mothers, happy Mother's Day. Y'all need a y'all need a whole week. Y'all getting a day? What's... Pff, might need to get y'all a month. What we need to do at least a week, though. I mean, we don't need a Mother's Day. We need a Mother's Week. Because without y'all mothers, and I hope, Mom, if you're watching, happy Mother's Day to you. I love you. Uh, and, yeah, but y'all need a week at least, Caitlin. You need a week. You need a week. And she needs several weeks because she's got one that's uh, on the way. OTW. Uh, but, yeah, happy Mother's Day. Early happy Mother's Day to you all. I hope y'all have a wonderful weekend. I'll see you right back here Tuesday night. Until then, stay safe, and God bless you all. See you.